My Miss name Universe is Kishima Vanessa Aoma Arichina. Miss Universe Nigeria 2024 is no other than Miss Taraba. Who has shown me so much love and so much support. Now, I have received an invitation from Miss Universe Nigeria 2024 to attend the Miss Universe Nigeria 2024 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 Miss Universe And I'm so excited to embark on this journey. And I just want to say thank you so much for this opportunity. And I'm looking forward to participating in Africa's most prestigious beauty pageant, Miss Universe Nigeria. Oh, hail the queen. Congratulations to Chichi Vanessa, your Miss Universe Nigeria 2024, ready to represent us with power and grace on the global stage as reactions flows left right and center on this how winning all my amazing people in the house my queens and kings my correct correct people them how are you all doing i just hope everyone is fine okay if today is your first time of coming across my channel you are highly welcome if you just join us thank you thank you so so much okay for being part of this amazing family and for my returnees thank you so much so if you have not smashed on that subscribe button please do so and turn on your post notifications so i'll be notified once i upload my videos okay so that you don't miss out on all my juicy juicy gist right here okay guys as so many people predicted when chi chi vanessa was uh, invited to come to nigeria to her motherland do modeling to come and do beauty pageant modeling and all that by silver bed group yeah it's silver bed group that actually invited her and um, some people were saying is it because that silver bed has gone down that nobody is no longer talking about a uh, silver bed groups and all that they just want to use chidima to revive their a uh, brand that has gone down and all that well whatever it is whether it's to use it to revive their brand that has gone down or they're actually doing it you know to do things right and to make nigeria proud whichever angle they are coming from they are all welcome is a welcome either okay as far as everybody is fine last last all right so the miss universe nigeria beauty project has been held and uh, it has been announced that chede ma matched as the winner okay now several celebrities and some people are saying why did she win uh why did they leave others who have been preparing right from the very start and order to allow chede ma to not just come in and win uh, this particular um beauty pageant and all that in fact it has not been easy a lot has been said since she won and even the people that supported her when the south africans you know asked her to leave their beauty uh pageant and all that hey they are not saying that it's very very unfair to others who have been preparing ever since you know and all that well i don't know why they did that is it for cloud chasing is it to draw attention well one thing i believe is that uh, those that have been preparing ever since they must have compensated them do you get they must have you know find a way of um, making them feel happy and cool about it and just accept chedema as the winner all right okay so in case if you don't know who chedema is and the story that is behind this her winning both in south africa when she was asked to leave their beauty pageant and here in nigeria when she won okay let me read a little bit of her story in south africa when she attended the beauty pageant in south africa Chedema is the lady who reached the top nine in the Miss South Africa 2024 pageant last month and was forced to withdraw after a massive call by South Africans for her to be removed from the pageant due to her missed heritage. Her father is Nigerian while her mom is a Mozambican. Following the controversy, she was invited to Lagos by the organizers of Miss Universe Nigeria to contest in their pageant, which she just won. Congratulations to her. Congratulations, congratulations to her. Okay. It, so for me, it's still just the same thing that Nigerians are saying because others have been there preparing for those beauty pageants, you know, rehearsing, working so hard um, for them to win this particular beauty pageant. And then Chidima, who never envisaged, who never considered herself who never like she never foresaw herself coming to nigeria even this year just because of the incident that happened at uh, south african uh, beauty pageant you know she's not right here all of a sudden and her coming home to her motherland is just to come and deprive others of uh, what they have been preparing since i would say of their right because they all have equal rights okay because this is her fatherland this is her motherland all right so looking at it you can't just blame the south africans too much and uh, you can't just blame the nigerians 
too much okay so this is a lesson for everyone to learn no matter where you are germany canada america no matter where you are always make sure you bring your children back home always let them know where they are coming from always allow them to visit their motherland their home country allow them to identify with people in that country whatever they are doing whatever business or whatever be can't you guys see um davido davido was born and brought up in america but when he wanted to go into music davido had to come back to nigeria do you get he didn't say ah, let me stay in america and uh, no 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 he knows that if he should stay there he's not going to you know pave ways that place is not going to pave ways for him and all that he just knew that coming back to my father's land to my homeland to my mother's land is the right place for me to stay and blow please parents this is what you guys should watch inculcate on your children always let them know about this thing no matter where you are there is no place like home no matter how they welcome you treat you and all that it is only your people that will allow you to have equal rights with them because when it gets to rights matter they will tell you that you don't have the same rights as me do you guys understand so that's one thing we should always um, teach our children let us all learn from this thing that has happened to vanessa Chedema additional. Now let's hear from Vidi and the very dark black man how he has reacted to this particular winning of Chedema additional. So as I predicted, they don't carry the Miss Universe, give Chidima. You understand why they try to be fair, they later end up not being fair at all. So because say, the girl gets more problem for South Africa, South Africa frustrated her, when I invite her come Nigeria, make she come be Miss Universe, when I carry the Miss Universe, give the girl. So how about the people that have been preparing for this thing for a long time? You understand how about the people that have been preparing for a long time because this one i'm pretty sure you people did not give up by marriage you people gave up by pity you understand people in the comment a face card a face card pageantry is not only about face card you understand this is not fair this is not fair at all this is favoritism this is pity 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 and this pity pity a lot of people don't use and take in a lot of things for this country it is not fair when i for even let the game if not for even let the game contest next year so that people don't prepare for this thing or just do their thing jj I understand that people try to convert it for clout. You understand? So that it will give it a little bit of more audience to watch it. But it's not fair at all. She doesn't deserve that thing at all. Also, you say Miss Taraba. That girl is not from Taraba State. I don't know why you people keep the pageantry, the modeling and pageantry thing in Nigeria. They are so lazy. You people are so lazy. You understand? There is what we call a uh, uh, talent hunt. If things like this, Miss Universe or Miss whatever thing is happening in Nigeria, you're supposed to go to each state. You bring them together. Let different girls come and show their talents. You understand? So that they'll contest for it. Then you bring people from the original state. You carry Mr. Raba now, they give person no come from Taraba. Mr. Raba, and she's not even from Taraba State. So how does she represent Taraba when she's not from Taraba State? Not only her, I am pretty sure the people that represent Minananja State are not from Minananja State. The pageantry people, people are lazy. Start going to all those states, you understand, and bring origin, bring uh, 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 people that are originally from that state to represent their states. She doesn't deserve it, though. I don't care which anybody won't talk. I don't care. I talk, I'm an so it happen. I don't care which anybody won't talk. The girl does not deserve it. I am sorry. All this one now, they die, eh, eh, so that she could go meet the Miss South Africa for on top stage. Miss South Africa said not even here. Yeah. Uh -huh. So anytime when I talk, that they say, nah, she not go here. They said they carry because of say the girl, not the year, they carry and give her. This time they create, this time they create another uh, 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 competition, I mean a competition for them, where we say they know the year. You understand? But again, well, it's just an African thing at the end of the day. You people just rob Peter to give it to Paul. Yes, yeah, you rob Peter to give it to Paul. Anyways, congratulations to your award, to an, uh, to an award that you don't deserve, actually. It's so sad. Me, I know they use sentiment. They talk anything. They invite me to go to church for dedication. You got to go away. Bye bye. Don't play. Peace and love. All right. We all know that uh, when the, this Saturday uh, Madishna was uh, asked to withdraw from the South African Beauty Project, um, very dark black man spoke extensively about it. You know, um, giving South Africans their own blame for not allowing Chidema to participate in their beauty pageants and others. And then again, now that she has won in Nigeria, he has also aired his view. He has also let people know that no, this is not fair to others. Okay, even as much as I supported her when uh, what happened to her in south africa happened there but right now they are not doing the right thing or they did not do the right thing by letting her be the winner of this uh, miss universe nigeria 2024 all right my queens and kings this is where i'm going to be drawing my contest what do you have to say about this drop your comment your opinion your contribution down in the comment section below this being said a very big congratulations to chichi vanessa additional we are so happy for her even though 
no matter how everything went we are still happy for her okay so let us know your opinion in the comment section what you feel or what you think about what has happened that's how winning okay in nigeria it's nigeria universe 2024 okay thank you so much for watching i appreciate you all do not forget to drop your comment we would like to get back to you okay so i'll be seeing you all in the comment section see you in my next video i love you all back to back